You know that it's a good idea to have a home inspection when purchasing an older home, but is it really necessary with new construction? That's what we're digging into today. Let's go. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Bryn Cook with Hearthstone Real Estate here in Eugene, Oregon. On this channel, I talk all about the Eugene area and give you some real estate tips along the way. Today's topic is coming from a personal experience that I've had. We made a couple of mistakes when purchasing our newly constructed home before I was in real estate. The first mistake that we made was not having a real estate agent representing us in the transaction. I actually made a video about that topic that I'll make sure to link to this video. Because we didn't have an agent, we didn't have anyone to talk through the process of buying a home, let alone discussing the benefits of having an inspection done on the home before we bought it. Now, we got lucky with our home. It has lasted really well for the past eight years. We haven't had any issues at all, but that's not always the case, even with new construction. Our logic for not having an inspection was that it just got inspected by the city, and if it passed their inspection, shouldn't we be good to go? Again, that's not always the case. Keep in mind, the city or the county inspector has different intentions. They work for the government and are reviewing the building code requirements at a minimum level. A home inspector that you hire is there for you. During the home inspection, you'll meet that inspector there in the home to discuss their findings. That's your opportunity to ask questions and decide if you want to go back to the contractor and ask for any repairs. You don't get that opportunity with a building inspector working for the city. If you request the repairs to be done prior to closing on the purchase of the new construction, you still have the opportunity to walk away from the deal if needed. That is, of course, if you are working with a realtor who wrote the inspection contingency into the contract. Again, a realtor will guide you through everything. As the first owner of the new home, you are essentially the guinea pig for all of the systems. At least when a home has been lived in prior to you purchasing it, the seller, in most cases, will need to disclose any issues that there may be with the home and its systems. That's not the case with new construction. Yes, the contractor may do a final walkthrough with you, but unless you have a construction background, you may not always know what to look for other than cosmetic items. How the builder or developer responds to your request for an inspection and request for repairs says a lot. Do they stand behind their work? Some of the items that may be wrong with the home are probably under warranty. If they are hard to deal with during this time, they definitely won't be easy to work with later on. Better to find this out before the purchase closes and it's officially your problem. There are certain items in new construction that can be more of a problem than you thought. Here's an example. I was once with a client during their inspection on new construction and the inspector recommended having a sewer scope done. Now that's counterintuitive because you would typically think that a sewer scope would only need to be done on older homes, right? With older homes, it makes sense that the pipes are old and may be deteriorating or in disrepair. But he shared that he has seen a lot of sewer line issues on new construction because those are the first things to go in on a new home. And then the heavy equipment rolls over the top of them. There's a pretty decent chance that there could be damage that you won't even know about until you've lived in the home for a while and started noticing problems. A sewer scope can call those problems out prior to living in the home and help to ensure that the issue be fixed before moving in. Again, it may cost a little extra money, but finding out about those issues before you move in can be well worth it. When it comes down to it, the real question about having an inspection done on new construction is why wouldn't you? Make sure to check out my other videos on buying real estate here in Eugene. I'd love to hear from you. You can call, email, or leave a comment down below. I work hard to stay connected. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and join me for my next video. Thanks so much for watching.